Rope Processor Zine here with Verbal Processing, and I am back, and I am back with a little game called Terraria. And the, according to the uh, the title bar up there, sand is overpowered, but we've all heard that before. Joining me today for this adventure map, uh, Zelda-related adventure map, is the in inestimable, the inestimable, the inestimable, the incontinent, Lord Divine, <laughs> Lord Divine, how you doing today? I'm doing excellent. I have a little green furry, and I apparently am some sort of Super Saiyan red-headed ginger from hell. Well, that's pretty much how it goes. I, I, I think that you just can keep little, uh, maybe little rings on your, on your ringlets there. So you know, ladies can store their, their jewelry on your head. It's a, it's a dating strategy, really. It, it, it's just like one of those fingers with the velvet and the creepy. How do you get into a lady's bedroom? Have her put your head on her dresser. That's, <laughs> that's how you manage it. All right, now it's time for me to rage. Rules: Throw away your starting items. You know that doesn't bother me at all. But here's where it gets annoying. You can buy items. Just not explosives, tools, accessories. This includes the rocket boost. No breaking blocks. You will need to place blocks to continue at some point. Just try to remember that you can do things, but you can't do things, but you can do them, but you can't do them. Which one is it? I mean, I'm just, it's, it's just like I, it's it's a it's a it's a massive pile of keep track of all this shit because I couldn't come up with a way to make it for you. This is like um, this is like buying a board game and you open up the box and it's just a piece of paper that says first you're gonna need to make a get a piece of cardboard and draw a grid. Onto that piece of cardboard. It's like we're gonna tell you how to play this game. Now but we're not actually going dice. to supply you with any <laughs> any sort of facilitation. All right, no breaking rules, but you will need to place blocks to continue at some point. You also can take can't take off the clo the clothes off the mannequins. Why did you put the clothes on the mannequins? I'm gonna. I, that's the first thing I'm doing. I, I, calling it right now. Gonna do if that. You are, first. If you are too. Uh, if there are there, uh, if there are two more signs next to each other, always read left to right. Explosives may only be used in Ganondorf's lair. Good luck and have fun. All right, no doubt about that. G -G. If you've watched Verbal Processing or Lords of Vines uh, before, you know how we feel about rules in these maps. We try to follow them, but if you have OCD, there is a back button right now. Go back to that search and hit another video because <laughs> this ain't the place for you. This is going to be brutal. Yes. <laughs> Yes, but if you want to enjoy our time together, then let it flow. You okay? Here we need we need a voice for this. Yeah, all right. Uh, you awaken and find yourself lying down in the sand. The ocean tide rushes in just inches from your feet. You have no idea where you are, and you know nothing of your surroundings either. You see an old wooden chest in front of you. Okay, now we have another sign here. Would you like to take this one? You hesitate to open it but you notice a faint glimmer coming from inside. You crack the creaking chest open and out flies a fairy. <laughs> That's not the first time that's happened to me. The fairy explains that she was trapped and is very Bring grateful that you saved her. She says she'll follow you into that dungeon. That's... All right, sweet. I like this so far. She tells you there's a wooden sword in that chest for protection. <laughs> I'm going to need a lot more than that to, for this fairy dirty... <laughs> 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 At the at the hilt of the blade, carved in the hardwood oak, is the name Link. And and what's your name, Link Two? Uh, <laughs> my, my name is my name is well, it's, I'm a different Link. Let's just put it that way. I'm Link Hayes. Link to the past. Uh uh uh. uh you know? Okay, I'm not actually that. No, that wasn't. Shaft, John Shaft. <laughs> Didn't Link Hayes play Shaft? Um, I couldn't tell you. I do All know right, that so. we have a crab problem over here. It's not just over there, my friend. Uh, I, okay, so yes, well they can just they can just hang out, whatever. It's cool, whatever. It's hey, I away. Go oh, ahead. I have a green fairy. That sucks, but I do like the Triforce here. That that's like pretty intense. Right, so I, there's my mana crystals here, and oh, how do I have mana? That and we both have. Yeah, well, there's it's from the chest. You didn't get it. Yeah, but I'm saying like I already have mana. I don't even have to use these. Oh, <laughs> and the cheating begins. <laughs> I'm a hacker. <laughs> I'm a hacker. I'm picking up all. The He's a hacker and a cracker and a Randy Hacker. butt sniff snacker. Uh, Randy butt crack butt crack snacker. <laughs> That's what it ought to be. Oh, I've already fallen and taken fallen damage. This is how this run's gonna go. I <laughs> can. Well, I mean, isn't that standard you feel for it? us? Yeah, I think that's, that's you know, guys. If you've been wanting your Blackbeard's castle fix, this is uh, this is where you be. This is where you're gonna get it from, right here. Oh, oh. Ah. Uh. Scumbag uh, cobwebs. Here. All right, Pilates have been working for me. There we go. Ah, yeah. Get up, son of a. <laughs> get out. Oh, oh. Nearly fell. Oh. Okay, there we go. I got it. I gotta back off the mic. How the hell are you doing it. so much better than me? Uh, it's an illusion. <laughs> 
It's a lie. <laughs> it's not real. You are not. Oh, we got a chest. Ooh, what is here. this? Chest Touch chest me. Chest dicks of flicks. All right, so we got uh, iron skin potion. Ooh. Oh, we each get two iron skin potion. Oh, you know what? I think this is what is the support of the four players. So I guess we each get one iron skin potion. Uh, so we don't just get to get everything. Yeah, you know, it's like like I said at the beginning, we'll we'll try to follow the rules. It's not a complete. Wait, so can we pick up healing items? Because I totally just did that. Yeah, if it's if it's on the map, go for it. I say. <laughs> okay, I see how that's gonna work. Ah, there we go. Wait, what's in there, mother? Let's see. You fat ass, get Five up there. Five <laughs> healing potions. Here, get get me mine. You want me to bring bring yours down? <laughs> yes, servant. Oh shit! Bring I think me. I just drank yours. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, so. Bring me my I, potions. Forgot how I actually drop things in Terraria. Is it uh, just Q for me? Q? Q or Q tilde? Q? Q? Yeah, I oh, can't Q. Oh, damn it. I just threw you my sword. Uh, <laughs> I'm never getting that back. There must be a way to do this. <laughs> no, because I can't drop things. No, that's swinging it. Ah, oh, got right, it. Right click, right click. Yeah. There we go. There we go. Hey, hey, hey. hey. There you go. It flew right in. Okay, so we have to backtrack a yep. little bit. Aren't mazes a totally awesome gameplay mechanic that not at all reminiscent of the earliest games from the Atari 2600 era? I think even at that time, they had better sense than to just to say, well, uh, what if you went through a maze in this game? How about that? Except mazes you know, usually, usually had pits in them too, so when you died, you had to start over in the maze. So they, Yeah, they put a few other things in there. I, I If... if <laughs> If my cynicism is not uh, easily registered, I don't like mazes in Terraria Adventure Maps. I love mazes in Terraria Adventure Maps because he hates them. Uh-oh. Stabbing time. Captain Stabbing at your service. Can we enable isn't that PvP a, Isn't that like a, a porn name, Captain Stabbing? <laughs> that's, that's just my... Oh, I went the wrong way! Why? Wow, did I actually choose the right direction? How the hell did Jump. that happen? Jump. Green fairy! A lot of... Okay. A lot of glass you find in the dungeons here in Hyrule, apparently. These glass windows are just... And they're kind of haphazard. Well, maybe they're being energy efficient. They're like, well, we could take some, you know, solar energy and use that to heat the place. Because, I mean, these dungeons are really cold. And you would not believe the electric bills that you it, get the here. The amazing view we have down here with the... With, <laughs> with the, the dirt. <laughs> hey, there's chests over here. Hey, now. Sup. Ooh, anklet of the wind. 4% movement speed. Don't mind if I do it. Can I get two of them? Diddly izzle. There we go. I'm not. I'm not gonna cheat. I'm not gonna cheat. No, of course. Why? Why would you cheat? He's just like cheating like a. Yeah, like I'm, a I'm gonna look into your inventory. You're gonna have three of those motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> you stay out of my. Okay. Here's here's a bunch of completely unnecessary mannequins that I accidentally just stole the robe off of. Yeah, I'm, I'm totally not that. gonna keep it. Completely. Okay. Why are these here? Oh wait, there's a sign down I'm here. I'm wearing Pop that. Screw that. I'm Lord Savine. I need a robe. <laughs> We are the seven sages of the land called Terraria. It is no accident that you have run into us. This land has been overrun with evil, and legend speaks of a young man that will bring about peace to this world. Take the hero's clothes from that chest and arm yourself with the sword of the hero. Seek out the seven medallions known as the souls of might. But first, travel east to Mundus Village. Mundus. Mundus. Wow, what you know a what? name. We gotta travel east to Mundus Village, but before we get there, there's something else we gotta do. What's that? We gotta end this episode! No! No. Uh, well, I took us in, you take us out, Lord Savine. <laughs> well, it's been uh, pretty crazy. I've stolen robes, I've uh, outsmarted Ian in the maze, and then taken fallen damage, so it just seems like a normal day in Terraria. We should be having a lot of fun coming up soon. You guys better catch it all. I'll see you guys Here. next time. On Lord Savine and Verbal Processing. By the way, if you like this video, please give it a like. It only takes a second. It helps our channels a lot. If you're new to Verbal Processing or Lord Savine, hit the subscribe button immediately. You will not regret it. We will bring you joy in your life. And, oh, we got stuff on Twitter and Facebook and all that stuff. But if you're really motivated, you'll check the links in the description. Until next time, this has been Ian with Verbal Processing for Lord Savine and the linky Terraria map thingy that we're playing. A link to Terraria. A link to Terraria. Cheers. See you guys.